Hey y'all, I've been wanting to do this video for a minute because I've been watching a lot of Michael Myers and I got my own conspiracy theory and I need y'all bitches to just hear me out. It is his sister's fault that he's trying to kill her. But one, if you look back and you think about it, first movie, Michael loved that little girl. Michael always cared about her. He always made sure she was straight. Regardless of everybody else that was in the house that was fucking with him, he always made sure that she was straight, which is why he came back for her. He came back to show her like, yeah, bitch, you my sister. I miss you. I need you. I ain't got nobody. I'm and then the bitch gonna stab him. Like, bitch, you're lame. Bitch, you're dumb. Bitch, you're a geezer. How you gonna let him do you like that? How you, how you, how you gonna do him like that? Now he's trying to kill you and you 60 with a baby and a baby with a baby and all this other shit. Now he's trying to kill your baby's baby and you. Michael Myers wouldn't have been a killer or he probably wouldn't have did half of the shit he did if people just treated him or cared about him like he was a normal person. Ain't he gonna lie. That's why he did that to Dr. Loomis shorter because Dr. Loomis made him feel normal until he, until, until he gonna tell him, like, yeah, 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 Michael, it was my fault. Bitch, why would you tell me that? Now I'm in with you too because you know I got all these ops. So you telling me that I got all these ops because of you? Dr. Loomis out here making documentaries and books and shit, talking shit about his boy. Shorty, I thought we was like this. I thought we was clicked in. Fuck you talking about. Then on top of that, Michael knows that the whole town knows him. Everybody know about him, but they still be treating him like he's a pussy, G. They still be trying to treat this man like he not that. I swear to God, Michael was the only motherfucker I know that'll bring a knife to a gunfight. I swear to God. And I also personally feel like everybody else that he be killing just be in the way. They be in his business. Maybe if you manage your business, maybe if you manage your business, you won't be in the way. He only killed the black people who act white. He only killed the black people who be acting white. I swear to God, if I see Michael, I'll be like, look, uh, shorty. I'm out your way. I'm out your shit for sure. I ain't see nothing. Personally, feel like he would stop killing people if his sister stopped acting like a bitch and face what she did. She started they beef. And the reason he killing everybody else is because they're getting in his beef with his sister. Like, this ain't got shit to do with y'all. Now y'all finna get it too. If somebody comes to him like, yeah, that bitch was wrong. She was petty as hell for that. Woo, woo, woo. She was wrong as fuck. Maybe he wouldn't be doing all that. Maybe if somebody had just actually understand where he's coming from, why he got beef with these people. Because motherfuckers not trying to see. This man used to get treated any type of way as a kid. He got tired of that shit. He got tired of that. Then people start treating him like he's not human. Like he's not a regular person with regular feelings. Man, one thing better than two things. For sure, all I know is me and Mike will be big bros. Fuck you talking about. I'll smoke the fattest wood with that man. I understand you for real, shorty. I swear to God, I, I feel like me and Mike will be cool. I feel like he would not kill me, G, because I'm just a cool-ass bitch. And I just really understand everything that he's saying and where he's coming from. If he decides to talk, you know, he could write it down, show me a picture or something. I'm going to get it. I, I already get it. Man, more of the story, he don't fuck with fake people. And I feel that. Come smoke with me, bro.